souls, hello, hello. <laughs> Happy Monday. Yes, we are on with the days. This is our pause right now. We are stopping to feel into ourselves, feel into our bodies, take note of what we need right now. Take note of what we need. <laughs> How are you feeling? Happy full moon. <sighs> Just clearing the energy a little bit. Mm. Clearing our divine energy, welcoming our ancestors in, our guides. where you are needing that deep breath more i just felt that in my chest like there's like a barrier to break past if you find yourself in shallow voices or shallow breaths sometimes shallow voices uh shallow breaths sometimes you'll find that there's a need for reset often and when you show up to that deep breath, um, you will get to feel <laughs> exactly where it is that your, your body is feeling that lack. Lack of, of breath, lack of attention, lack of it all, of anything. I also got the note just now to just invite you to breathe healing <clears throat> and light into the part of your body that feels any kind of pain, any kind of um, discomfort. Breathe intentional healing into that space. As I was stretching this morning and doing my balancing, I realized that my knee has a little pain going on there. A little foreign pain. I'm like, what's this about? So I'm going to breathe some healing and love and light and honor and gratitude into my knee. <laughs> Where can you breathe that into your body? I'm also going to breathe that into my head, my skull, my brain, the back of my neck that houses and hosts the head, and bringing healing and life and energy into that portion of my body. Headaches. Been having headaches the past two days.
in me that holds me stagnant, still in the same place. I release all energies within me that do not align with my highest self. I release and accept all versions of me that got me to this very place, this very space with myself, with my community, my collective, my ancestors, my spirit guides, Ah, I release you all who have gotten me to this day. In this powerful full moon, I step forward into the life of ease. The life of surrender. I have a question. When you hear the question or the word life of ease, what does that mean to you? What does that look like? Really imagine it. Ease. Things just flowing to you. Things simply aligning to you at the right time, <laughs> just so magically. What is ease? How would ease feel with you, for you? Additionally, hello. How does the word surrender sound to you? Surrender. What does that mean? Because in this full moon energy, this Sagittarius energy, this you energy, who you are, how you wake up and accept your energy is pushing you to ask yourself these questions. You've got to know what you want. You've got to know what you are letting go. You have to be able to itemize the very things that are holding you back that way you know exactly what you are transmuting going forward. That way you know exactly what you are working on in order to break the wall to the next version of you. What are you changing day to day that's bringing you to your next self? How can you have such magnificent goals such powerful, ginormous goals with not a single, single switch of mindset, 12-12, it's 12-12, action and alignment, surrender to it all. <laughs> oh, I'm just so excited because it's really exciting once you crack the code. Once you crack the code of your foundational self-love, the trust, and the surrender. Just pure surrender to the universe. What are you bringing me today? Because I can handle it all. I can take it all. I can align with it all. I can smile through it all and truly authentically enjoy it all because of the work that I have done in my soul, in myself. 
the conscious effort that I took at looking at myself. And so now I just get to flee. I just get to be. I just get to exist. And my purpose vibrates and aligns with me, whether I show up or not. And so from there is the material plane, right? This is when we get to manifest real and true things. When you say I align with $10,000 this month, $10,000. When you have assured that you have put forth the work, when you have ensured that you put forth the belief in your heart that you really fucking deserve that $10,000. You have to believe it. And so you may feel this tiny glimmer of that's not possible. And that that's the exact glimmer that is going to be your work for the next weeks, months, years until that glimmer is gone and you stand firmly and believe that you will align with $10,000 next month straight up and it's magic and I guarantee it's just a it's just a beautiful thing when you make that mindset shift when you essentially transcend and delete any doubt within your mind because you trust yourself you love yourself you show up for the tasks the habits the actions that are going to lead you to your higher self you do the work you journal you meditate you breathe life into your body and move it around and you dance in this humanness and then you just wake up and be and all of a sudden everything is aligning to you without lifting a finger because you've done it you have surrendered to the human existence you have surrendered to your alignment to universe <sighs> it's beautiful I'm excited for that for you <sighs> let's breathe into that my goodness what a message my goodness that all of what I just said that is a life of ease that right there you've got to do the work the life of ease it's on its way to you I pulled this card today I pulled it and it's out for me but I felt compelled to bring it to you it's a full moon tonight, a powerful moon to get what you want. Believe in the magic. Believe that this is indeed a portal. All full moons are portals for you to get to the nitty gritty, get to the core and the root of it all and release it. Get it out of you. Get it out. <laughs> So I'll read more about this. It says wealth of ease. Number 16, which is card seven. So wealth of ease. We're going to meditate right now on a life of ease. Oh my goodness. You can breathe. No control. You're just surrendered. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Invite some deep breaths. Delicious breath. Mm. If you're resonating with this in the rewatch or anything, just share this, share this energy with your friends, with your community. They need this awareness, this light. And you and I will be exchanging energies as well. Mm. Hold it at the top if you feel aligned. Just take a deep breath and hold it at the top.
you've been holding your breath, that's what I've been doing.
anything keeping you from your life of ease. Meditating always just puts a smile on my face. I always get so like, <sighs> I'm, I just love my life. It's just absolutely wonderful. <laughs> so let's talk about this card. I also want to do a tarot reading because it's the full moon. I would love to see what energy is afoot for us. So let me be quick, not quick, but in divine time <laughs> so wealth of ease this is the energy right now we don't want to work too hard for anything we want to we that stack on the bottom like we want to align with that just by waking up just by not lifting a finger okay it just comes to us because that's just what we align with a wealth of ease is accepting that in our society we've been just taught and just pushed into our head that our value is intrinsically tied to our physical labor our physical worth and even our mental worth and our mental labor and so much of our existence has been programmed into being a transactional existence where you say well I want that but I know that I have to do this to get it I have to work to get it I have to um, just anything like it's transactional you got to do something in order to receive it and so that's why a lot of us are very stuck in the the um, suppressed energy of manifesting of manifesting what we truly desire as humans we are magic that's the first thing to start understanding and that's the first thing to start believing in your soul mind body and soul that as human design as you hu not human design as human beings we are magic so accept that magic and get curious about what your magic is specifically because you're here to do something pretty powerful and your self-love tied in with your true belief that you are magic is going to be imperative, imperative moving forward. And this is why a lot of humans do not succeed. They do not go to the, to the level of being just these master manifestors essentially, but really having the true life they desire. Look at people that do have money. They have the audacity to believe that they can have everything they want. Yet in poverty, we are tying the uh, our strenuous acts to what we receive. No, we don't have to do that. And so we work on cracking that code and we work on accepting the wealth of, of ease that we are here to, to have. So what it says, and you can just say this out loud, replay this, write it down, do it as many times as it takes to believe that you deserve a life of ease. All that I seek flows easily and effortlessly to me in perfect time. I am blessed to have all the time, energy, and resources needed to make my dreams come true. I claim ease and flow in all I do, say, and create. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> we just love that. Claim that ease. If you are claiming a life of ease, if you are stepping into your magic, into your power, into who you are, claim it. Um, comment that you claim it. Leave an emoji. Share this to a friend. Oh my gosh, we are in the energy of community Sagittarius season. Ah, and it's a, it's a Gemini full moon right now. And so you're gonna be feeling a lot, you're gonna be feeling on and off about a lot of different things. Gemini air sign, it's just, you're like this. One minute you're focused on this, next minute you're focused on this. And just have grace when it comes to that. Everything is in alignment. Just like we said, a life of ease. <laughs> you are deserving of everything, gosh. If there's anything you take away from this, just know that you deserve everything. You do. And you don't have to you don't have to work your ass off for it. You don't. <laughs> 
my gosh. There's so many people just losing their, their lives to, to just labor. Just labor out there. But I get it. That's what we've been told. I get it. But you get to choose, though. <sighs> Ready? What energy do we have today in this wonderful... Oh my gosh. Stop. Don't stop. Give me more of that. Let's see. <laughs> what is the energy today? I understand. Okay. Got it. Oh, okay. In this full moon. In this full moon. I like... Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> this is so great. Oh my gosh, I'm glad you love this message. It just got really, it really got even cooler, okay? Really more powerful. Very first card that comes out. King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles, oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm gonna make a separate YouTube video about this. Go to my YouTube and you'll find it probably tonight because this is i gotta share this whole, i gotta do this but <laughs> so because we are go, we're in sagittarius season we are going to be going into capricorn season and we are set up for the energy to receive this king of pentacles but we are talking about the energy right now we said what is the energy right now in this full moon okay the full moon in gemini in sagittarius season and um, we get that material wealth. What you've been working on is coming. What I was saying, you've got to believe it's coming. Allow the life of ease. Allow the surrender. The overthinking and over planning and all of these backup plans you're making just in case your extreme goal doesn't happen. Stop. Yes, be prepared, but you need to believe that it's yours. And you're going to get it. I I promise okay universe says here you go let's go but then there's the temperance as well and I felt it when I said I promise I'm like don't don't say that you've got to balance okay <laughs> you've got to have the balance you are going to be mixing alchemies between the past the presence we just got out of Scorpio season that's deep energy okay you're not just going to catapult into dream blossom beautiful land I mean we'd love to but no you've got to balance the energies you're going to be going in and out of shadow work and that is okay because this is what this is the message that we receive you are getting the bigness let's let's do this this way balance I, I'm such a Libra but yeah Yes, you're going to be making that money. Actually, this is how it goes. You're going to be making that money, getting the alignments with what you are going for, but also you are doing the shadow work. You're healing the emotions. You're healing the things that come up. Things are going to come up. Please don't push them down. This is the time that you know what to do, okay? And you know when it's time to do the work, when you feel it in your heart. Your heart quivers a little. Um, you feel a little bit uncomfortable when someone says something. Ask yourself, why do you feel that way? What's going on? What's going on, self? I know you just felt some discomfort. What can I do in this moment for you? Okay, and that is the balance. Because I asked for more and the higher front came out. This is a deeply spiritual time like the, you're going you're about to get spiritual about your your life about your money about your life of ease your wealth of ease that you're about to be sitting in and being in and on the bottom of the deck is the freaking the king of king of swords you know what this is about you know what you are going for if i were you in this full moon in gemini I would sit down, one, two, three, four is the time. I would sit down and get real. Itemize it, itemize what you are going for. Itemize what you are letting go, okay? Because the six of wands, yes, the six of wands is on, is right under that king of swords. Step into the spotlight. You know what's up. You know what you need to do. You know it, okay? So do it because this energy, you're aligned to win in this life of ease it's scary i know to surrender but beyond it is so much power Woo! so thank you so much for joining me today for coming here i am melanie of melamind i just want you to love yourself and oh my gosh join me on youtube because i'm gonna make i'm about to make a longer video on all of this okay love
love you. Thank you so much for coming. Ooh, and meditate on this if you feel it. Sit in silence with this. You've got this. Ugh. Yay. Yes, you do, girl. Have a great day. Bye.